All right, so I ordered these batteries from, I wanna say the name of the company is Advanced Lithium. They're in Shenzhen, China. I used to do uh, flight tests for student pilots of that airline, oddly enough, Shenzhen Airlines. So these are supposed to be 200 amp hour batteries each, packaged quite nicely. Little instruction manual. It's in Chinese. I won't be able to read it. There's a little bit of English in there. Um, it's got the data on charge settings and stuff like that. So that's important and good. Some application examples, which is also helpful because I know exactly how I want to use it. Uh, let's see, there's some hardware for it. I'm going to drop this box and set the battery on the counter. All right, so uh, let's see, it's got a little power button there, 87%, 13.2 volts, 28 degrees Celsius, it's a cool little feature. They'll be in a box in the van, so we won't really see them in that anyways. Advanced Energy is the name of the company. If anybody wants a link, I can send it to you. However, lithium, a 100 amp hour lithium battery should weigh uh, approximately 30 pounds. Um, that's including the box, the packaging. So what I did, I thought these were a little bit light for a 200 amp hour battery. So I've got my uh, scale here. Let's see, I'm probably gonna have to move the camera to be able to see it. But I don't think these are 60 pounds. And it turns out that it's not. Holy shit. 46.3 pounds. So, I'm not exactly sure these are going to work out the way I expect. Um, I do believe it's going to be more than a two uh, than a 100 amp hour lithium battery, but it's definitely not the 200 amp hour that I had ordered and expected. It's gonna take a little bit of time and testing to figure out what they actually are, what they produce as far as power. But I do like the packaging. Um, maybe there was, I'm gonna go through my emails with them and make sure that it was pretty clear what I was expecting in the order. Uh, maybe I miscommunicated with them or something. I can't imagine that though. Well, let's see, they've got these nice little studs as I throw it all over the floor. So that'll be convenient for the hookups. So I've got three of these. So. I'm thinking maybe 450 to 500 amp hours by the weight anyways. And I may be off on that. Uh, time will tell. I'm not really a battery expert, so I'll do some more research and figure out exactly the power output of these batteries. And they cost me around 500, 550 each. And then shipping was another 500. Uh, a little give or take a little bit anyways I think they were still a pretty good deal definitely a lot cheaper than any other options and uh, I like to do some experimenting so this will be a fun one we'll see how it works I wanted to uh, double check what they've got here I don't know if I'll be able to see that display uh, this battery is saying it's 13.2 volts the meter reads 13.3, so that's cool. This one, 
It says 13.1 volts, and it's reading 13.13. Can you see that thing? About like that. Oh, yeah. And this third one is 13.1 volts as well. And it's reading 13.17. So that's good. Uh, as far as measurements, size-wise, the case itself, including this little pop-out for the handles, is 21 inches by about nine and a half, nine and three eighths. So the three of them together will fit easily right square in the middle of the uh, underbed area that I have for the van. Um, I'm gonna put this video together, send it on the internet, and then uh, go and work on the van some more.